Hi guys, Hamster here. I wanted to talk to you guys tonight about game changers. What are game changers? To me, a game changer is not a new product. It's, it's not a new, just something new on the market. It's something revolutionary on the market. It's a new technology on the market. Um, for me, an example of a game changer, a game changer to me would be the 1911 pistol. That changed firearms forever. And for, and for the better. The 1911 was a game changer. Um, the AK-47, I would say, would be a game changer. Uh, the M16, which is, you know, morphed into the M4, I, I say is a game changer. It is that revolutionary and that much of an advance in technology that it overwhelms everything else and how we do things. Um, some other examples of that might be night vision. Totally new technology, changes the whole game, revolutionizes nice how things are done and there's a couple products that I'd like to share with you guys that I think everyone it should get more exposure more people should know about it and everyone should have it and that are two items obviously from the backdrop tonight you can see it has to do with first aid and the two items that I'd like to share with you guys tonight that I feel are game changers that didn't exist two three years ago these products did not exist. And I think these are going to change things so revolutionary, they are going to save so many lives. And I don't think you can afford to be without these in your first aid kit or your blowout bag. The first one is new from Quick Clot, Quick Clot Combat Gauze. Outstanding product. This is about four foot of impregnated gauze with a material that will cause your blood to clot 10 times faster than normal. This requires virtually almost no training to use. You basically pack it on the wound or into the wound and then apply direct pressure for five minutes. It is amazing product. These are two products, your first go-to products in the event of a major major wound with massive bleeding. These are many products that you're going to want to go to first in your kit. These aren't some last resort like a tourniquet. These are going to be the first items you want to use. The Quick Clot Calmbite Gauze. It works by clotting your blood. It's a gauze that you can pack into the wound, apply with pressure, and will stop the bleeding quickly. Don't worry about the gauze being left in the wound. It's got a, a strip in it. It will show up on an x-ray. It won't be left in the patient. Uh, these products, when you use them on somebody, make sure you attach the bag to the patient so when they go to the hospital, the people in the hospital know what they've been treated with. Very simple product. Pack the wound, apply direct pressure, then bandage and transport. And then you have this product here, which is an amazing product called Cellux. Uh, I have it here in a granular form. This is available in two forms. It's available in impregnated gauze, or in a powder like granular form. Since I already have the quick hot combat gauze, I wanted this in the granular form. It gives me more options. How do you use this one? Very simple. Tear the package open, pour the contents in the wound. If there's a pool of blood in the wound, scoop out the pool of blood, pour contents of package in the wound, apply direct pressure for five minutes. Once bleeding is stopped, bandage and transport outstanding products that uh, need to be in your first aid kit. Some new technologies have become available. We need to update our kits. These will save your life or someone else's life or your family's life. But uh, if you putting items in your blowout bag, uh, look at this item and uh, combat gauze. Outstanding. This, this product here and an Israeli bandage You'd be amazed what you could do with this, those two items. Just a packet of this and an Israeli bandage, which has so many functions and can be used as an improvised tourniquet, a pressure bandage, a blood stopper. Between that and this, that's about all you need to stop a major bleed. So not that often that products come along that are that 
revolutionary that have that much technology. Do some research, quick clock combat gauze. This is a little more expensive. This is about $35 to $40. Well worth it. It's lightweight, it's small, maybe three quarters of an inch, half inch, easily fit in your, uh, in your gear. This is like maybe three eighths of an inch. Weighs next to nothing. You can fit a couple of these. This and a pressure bandage, amazing. This is $15. There is no way you can afford not to have this in your home med kit, your big med kit, your blowout bag. You need to put some of this in there. I'm saying like this and an Israeli bandage, miracle workers. These things did not exist three years ago. I don't think these products existed or you could buy these three years ago. So there's been some huge leaps in technology. So you need to get out your first aid kits, good time to inventory, see what has expired, because all items expire, these do expire, these are good for maybe three years, and they need to be replaced. But uh, check out the Quick Clot Combat Gauze and the Celux in the powder or the impregnated gauze, and um, these are must-have items. I mean, we spend a lot of money on other new technologies, on optics, we need to spend some money on the latest cutting edge technology in the medical department because this will save your life. So, thanks for watching.